but it ain't no lie, baby. You may hate me, but it out. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to UFC 3 Career Mode, the absolute most historic episode episode of the series. You know why? You should know why. If you don't know why, I don't even know why I'm explaining this to you. Break six performance records and two promotion records to become a legend, AKA a goat, the greatest of all time. I have done 11 out of 12 consecutive title defenses. Let's flip back over here. Let's see what we got going on tonight. 96% peak fitness. Fight hype is high. Everybody's anticipating this fight. Punk is damn 50 something years old. This is it, all right? It is all or nothing. Is this the last episode of the series? I'm not even really sure. It might be. The story might end after you complete the promotion records. I don't know. Don't know. But Punk versus the Doru, the Doro, the World Middleweight Championship is on the line. New York, New York. It's about to go down. We're not. We're changing. No, you know what? We're not. We're not no, I'm not going to change trunks. I was going to change trunks, but you know what? No, you know what? No, you know what? We don't need to do that. We don't do that. We're on a something. We're on 11 something winning streak, whatever. We, why risk it? Why risk it? When the Eagles. When the Eagles won, got like six, seven, eight game in a row win streak, whatever it was during the season, I did not wash my damn Eagles hoodie that entire time. That's just facts. Punk championship. This is a fighting champion, man. I, I go out there every damn night. Not every night, every couple months, whatever. And I put the friggin' title on the line like a champion does. How is he the number one? Uh, he believes this title shot should have come a long time ago. But he has let bygones be bygones. The focus now on seating the champion in dominant fashion. No. You're not going to do it. It's not going to happen. Because what's going to happen is this man. The best in the world. Welterweight champion. Middleweight champion. World heavyweight champion. Tag team champion. Etc. Etc. You get the picture. That was, the, that was other times. That was previously. He's 51 yet. 51 years of age. This time, because y'all were yelling at me last time, I will let Brucey talk and I will shut up. This is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, and now not later. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out. Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed USC Middleweight Championship of the World. It's who is the first fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record on. 29 wins, 15 losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting in Toronto, Ontario, Canada, presenting the challenger, Elias the Spartan, the Apollo. I was unimpressed with your introduction. To be honest. Theodoro. Theodoro. Introducing the champion. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record on. 31 wins, two losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Chicago, Illinois. Ladies and gentlemen, the reigning, defending UFC middleweight champion, CM Punk. Ah! It's fight time. The talk is over. It is here and now. Now or never. Yodoro, your fate is in your hands. Good, good for you, sir. I will make this quick and painless then. I will make this quick and painless for you, Elias. You about to walk with me, sir, and I'm gonna walk you right out to your car. Cause we gonna walk you right back to the vehicle that you done showed up in. You, punk, little, man, son, bo boy of a 
gun. One more, and then bye. Bye, bye, bye. That's an NSYNC song. Don't want to be a fool for you. There's another player in here. I don't know the words. I'm just kidding. I know all the words. You may hate me, but it ain't. No. Oh, live, baby! You may hate me, but it... Oh! Oh, wait, I like that kick. Why haven't I been using that kick? That kick is lit. So I can either come to you that side, and then after I do that, if I shake you a little bit, I let my stamina back a little bit, then I come at you from that side. Oh, and I do it again! And it ain't no, no lie, baby. Bye bye. Let's friggin' go. With that kick, I got a new that new kick was dope. But you should have known that one was coming. Oh, he covered up too, just not the right place. He covered here, I got him here. He covered here, I got him here. That's not a good place to get him. That's not a good place to get caught. It's not a good place to get got. I'm sorry to do it to you, man. <coughs> I'm sorry you had to be the one. But ladies and gentlemen, we have done. We now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki's going to stop for this contest. At two minutes, seven seconds of the very two oh seven, not bad. Declaring the winner by knockout and still and still undisputed. Undisputed. Who's gonna dispute? Un. Nobody. CM Punk and still the king of at the top of the mountain, king of the hill, lord of the dance. Look at that, he's hype. Thanking his team, is a team, is a team effort, is a team effort. You gotta be ready, you gotta be trained. I think CM Punk's going out on top, y'all. Conor McGregor talking about, oh, can you be, can you be the goat like Conor McGregor? Can you be the goat like Conor McGregor? And bam, consecutive USC title defenses, 12 out of 12. Six out of six, break six performance records. Contract has been fulfilled. $2.8 million. Give the man his money and give the man his spoils. Greatness is a feat chased by many, but achieved by few in the UFC. Mm -hmm. To get there, it takes more than talent and skill. Mm -hmm. To be great, it also takes heart, determination, the willingness to fight the best, and the ability to beat them. He's a legend, a big, big staple in the sport and a pioneer in MMA. Over the course of his UFC career, this fighter has done that and more, taking the sport to a new level in the process. Mm. He's been a world champion in multiple weight classes. He's made a ton of money and he's achieved everything he'd ever wanted. There is no question that he is the greatest of all time. Woo! You heard it here first. Oh, career end. Greatest of all time. That's it. UFC 358, hashtag and still CM Punk, middleweight champion. It said career end. Greatest of all time. I don't want to press continue. What happens if I press continue? Okay. Let the rain begin. I, I already done rained. It's been pouring. You have unlocked legendary difficulty. Hey! To the no, hell no, no! That's all you get. You are now the greatest of all time. You now have the option to retire while on top or continue your career to your longevity has run out. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Okay, we've had a great run. Seventeen episodes here on UFC. UFC Seventeen episodes here on UFC three with CM Punk. We've fought the best. We've beaten the best. We had some ups and some downs. What a 32 and 2 record, 33 and 2 record, whatever the hell it was. Greatest of all time. CM Punk is not only the best in the world, but he's the greatest of all time. We did it. And at 51 years old, coming out at, at about half, he only got about half, he only got about half a tank left. If that. I think it's time for CM Punk to do the right thing. To walk away on top, to ride off into the sunset as the best in the world and the greatest. It is time to retire. That was your last fight. And while you won't hear the fans cheer your name as you walk out again, you still have all the records, championships, and victories in the octagon 
to think about. You showed up to every fight. Not only did you exceed expectations, you set the bar on what being great is. All the blood, sweat, and the time given to the sport has taken a toll on you. It absolutely has. We all know it and you know it. But now it's time to enjoy the fruits of your successes. It's very important to appreciate the things that you accomplished and enjoy the fruits of your labor. Enjoy life knowing you are the greatest of all time. So from me, the goat, to y'all, the goats, the greatest duo of all time. This is a little shorter episode than I wanted to be, but that's gonna be it for this UFC 3 career mode featuring CM Punk. Is this the last UFC 3 career mode we're gonna do? That's a good question. I will leave that to y'all. Hit me up on Twitter at the Chris Danker. Leave some comments down below on Instagram at the Chris Danker. Facebook, Facebook. I don't know what Facebook is. Facebook slash Chris Danker. You know, it's up down in the description. Follow you, boy. Hit me up. Let me know. Let me know what you think. We'll see. We'll see. But either way, I appreciate the love and the support on this series. You guys really showed up and uh, and showed your support on every video. So thank you so much for that. I greatly appreciate it. Stay tuned for much, much more. Got pretty great. I swear I've done videos before. I've done outros like 3,000 times. But for some reason, I can't do that. <laughs> I love y'all. Just know that. I appreciate you. And I'll see you next time. Peace.